to the train, folks. Come in here. That's probably what y'all would have heard if he was if he was on his Snapchat right now. As you can obviously tell who this is. This is DJ Khaled. Musician, producer, uh, celebrity, what do you call it? Social media celebrity, stuff like that. Snapchat legend. I follow him on Snapchat and that dude he's motivational, yeah he's hilarious at the same time. I don't know if it's a, if it's his intention to be hilarious, but he's very funny and motivational at the same time. Every time we see him on social media, he's talking to his flowers, talking to his son, which is a beautiful thing. You know, always talking about did the Drake vocals coming yet, and that's where this this face came from. This is the famous Drake vocals face. saying we the best and stuff he's, he's very very inspirational though he always has a message of positivity you know, in his music you know he's always, he's always giving out affirmations we the best and you know, we taking over very very inspirational Excuse me. And he is a person like no other. Like no other. He is quite a unique person. But you can't take your eyes off of him. I mean he does, he makes very good music. I mean he's not just here just you know because you know he's a personality like his music stands on its own. Like when you hear DJ Khaled song or DJ Khaled record, it it plays on the radio. I mean, I don't know how many times I've heard "Shining," but that song has been playing for the longest time. But it's a very good song, so it's obvious he knows what he's doing quite obvious that that man knows exactly what he's doing so if you want to be on snapchat screaming that the drink book was coming yet or something like that he could do it when it, uh, much as he want he has earned the right to scream that the drink book was coming yet and from what I've heard on social media the drink vocals did come in he finally got the drink vocals but I like about uh, I love his message his message is all about positivity and all about making things happen when you say something you know when you, you bring it into fruition because every time you say he's going to do something you see him working towards it and then it comes true so I'm not surprised that the Drake vocals came in <laughs> he works towards it he makes things happen and when, it, when he drops whatever he got to drop it does very well does very very well. And I didn't even know that his name was just Khaled Khaled. I found that interesting. I was like, what is his name? DJ Khaled. I was DJ Khaled. Like, what is his name? It was DJ it's, it's Khaled Khaled. I was like, wow. Wasn't expecting that. But, hey. There you have it. Khaled Khaled.
Yeah, I look for not going on my Snapchat. I look forward to seeing him on there because I mean, people may laugh at him about it, but to me, there's a there's a deep science to what he's doing. I believe, like him talking to flowers. You know, how people who who have nurseries. Not like not like say nursery people who deal with flowers. It's called a nursery. You know, they say that if you talk to the flowers, you know, they grow. Flowers understand. Uh, they understand that. And he does that. Always talking to his flowers. I was saying, he was rubbing some. I love you. I love you. Hey, man. nothing wrong with that. It's beautiful. Flowers and stuff all over the place. It's beautiful. And obviously he has no problem with self-confidence because he's always having his shirt off and stuff, showing his body, always working out. So he does not lack confidence. I I, I appreciate that about him. He's never without confidence. Every time you see him, he's never without confidence. I'm pretty sure he has a down. Well, everyone has a down moments, but he is never without confidence. Every time you see him, he's photo shoot, probably with his shirt off or something like that. And... He's just, you know, confirming the message of just positivity. And that's a beautiful thing. I, I, I think we need more people like DJ Khaled. We need more DJ Khaled around here. With that kind of energy, that kind of perseverance. Because he gives people, you know, the, the drive to just keep going. I mean, just think about how many people actually listen to what he's saying and then apply what he's saying. Just think about, just think about when someone wants to give up, or when someone is speaking negatively about someone else, and he says, "Don't listen to they." Just think about the science of that. He says, "Don't listen to they. They don't want to see you win. They don't want to see you do this, this, and this." Like he always says that. They don't want to see you have a drop top. So we got a drop top. Like, to me what he's saying is, those who are speaking negatively about you, they don't want to see you happy. So what do you do? Instead of give in to them, you pursue that happiness. That's what you do. You pursue the happiness. They don't want to see you win. So we keep winning. You no, know, they don't like it's like no, they don't want to see you. They don't want to see you go here and do this. So we went here and did this. No, I love it. It's a it's a beautiful, empowering message, especially like with social media. DJ Khaled was made for social media. I mean, if you gotta think if his message, which I'm which I'm sure he's been talking about for the longest time, wouldn't have went over 15, 20 years ago, there wasn't no social media back then. But now you have social media, you got Instagram, Snapchat. I mean, DJ Khaled is the king of Snapchat. Let's just make that clear. He's the king of Snapchat. If it ain't him, is Kevin Hart. Those are like the, the two biggest, in my opinion, the biggest people on Snapchat. And... His message of positivity and never giving up and don't listen to they. That stuff resonates with people. It resonates with me. Like you, it's like, like you, you always seem like he's not going anywhere. And why would you want somebody talking about positivity to go somewhere? Why would you want somebody talking about, you know, doing great things to go somewhere. Why would you want that?
You know I'm saying people like that they need them around. They 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 lift people up. They lift people up. So I thank DJ Khaled for his message. I really do. This is actually my first time drawing DJ Khaled. My first time. And I'm liking how it's coming out so far. Now we're gonna do the body. Get the drink, folks. Come in, yeah. And it was one. It was one thing I saw on Snapchat where he was calling for his wife. Like, honey, 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 and she got annoyed. <laughs> hey, honey. Then she, then she's like, stop. Like, you gotta believe in me. You gotta believe. In me. <laughs> like, what in the world? But I watch, man. Is you gotta believe in me. I like that. That man's come up with so many different slogans and catchphrases. He got other he got other people saying did the Drake he got Drake saying did the Drake vocals come in yet? Anybody that want to do vocals, he was like, like you gotta get him doing that. Like he's 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 used social media to change things up, and he has been able to be thoroughly successful with it, which is a beautiful thing. Which that's what it's meant for. Social media is meant to for these kind of things. So why not use it? That's that's what that's what it's made for. Uh, let's see, Amanda. I'm gonna just give him a playing background. A little something different with him too. Let's see. Um, Do a little background shadow. Almost done, almost done, almost done. Now, how am I going to do this? Oh, let me sign my name. This is the third, yes, third, so six, three, six, right there. I got to do it, y'all. 
I gotta do it. This is by far one of my favorite ones to draw. Thank you all for watching. Leave a comment down below. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. I will catch you all later. Peace. Is it Drake, folks? Come here.